protect the bunnies! Hey, hey, little Oli. It's okay. Those monsters are gone now. The bunnies are safe. We're all safe. No! It's not safe! He's coming! Who's coming? My dad. Your dad? The butcher? He says little bunnies are good for nothing! Nothing but food! Here, little bunnies. Ah! Don't run, or else Daddy's gonna kill ya! <laughs> fun! Fun! Now we're getting chased by a giant butcher, okay. Okay, he's really close. He's really close. Holy crap. How do we get him? How? Oh! 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 I think we got hit there. How do we hit him? Jeez! That's not working, obviously. How can we? Oh, oh, I know, I know, I know. Confusion grenade. I think. I hope. No! Oh! Get up, get up. No! Okay, we might have had to climb higher that time. That's okay. As long as we're alive, we can try again. Oh, wrong direction. It's kicking us! Are you confused yet? No, that did nothing. That did nothing. I think maybe this is one of those Don't ones that we just have to wait out. Or else daddy's gonna kill ya. Okay, then let's try doing that then. Wait for him to get his thing stuck in the ground again. Like that. Good hit, good hit. Now we'll just keep escaping. Oh my Don't dear lord. Run, or else Daddy's gonna kill ya. Oleander sure had a scary dad. Really? Oh, what a waste of opportunity. Didn't get him right. Come on. Bunny. Bunnies don't have much meat on them anyway, right? Don't you? Like, if you're a butcher shop, you would be focusing on pork and stuff. Not bunnies, I hope. Get out of here. Let's get out of here. We don't have a lot of health left, so we gotta be quite careful. Come here, little bunny. Not a bunny. That's good, that's good. Oh no. Oh, I can't believe this. I missed three opportunities. Could have killed him twice by now. It's okay. As long as we don't get hurt, we can continue on. If we if we're hasty bun, bun, bun. and lose, that's worse. So calm down, calm down. Um. We're back in the meat circus instead of the circus circus. going on here? What have you done to our circus? Guess who that is? Dad! Polluted. Perverted. This looks like the work of mentalists. I can explain. Have you been associating with psychics? Dad, I... Psychics. Fortune tellers. 
They killed your grandfather. They cursed our entire family to die in water. Yes, but... Including you, Rasputin. And me. But I'm going to live. You know why? Because I'm still an acrobat. Let's see if you are. This is where the meat circus truly begins. <sighs> What's it going to be, son? Die in the water? Or show me what you got? Now we know where we take our skills from. Holy crap. I mean, we're good, but are we that good? Well, we better be that good, because look down there. Water, lovely. Ridiculous. Why would a father do this to his own son? Thanks for the tip, game. All right. Where am I going? Okay, I missed my chance. That's not good. Okay. There you go. Thanks, Dad. Thank you, Dad. You ass. Where are we going? Oh, up here. Up here. Up. Oh, what the heck? Really? Come on. Oh my dear God. The water level. The water level. Maybe if you spent more time practicing your acrobatics and less time reading those comic books, you used to like to play catch with me. I still play catch with you, but I want to be a psychic too. They're not mutually exclusive, Dad. You don't have to be an ass about this. Hey, son, catch! Stop it! You're an ass! There you go. <laughs> there you go. Oh, I'm just getting pummeled! Jesus! Dear God. Dad. Thanks for loving me. I can feel the parental love. No! No! <laughs> Little help? Dude, the water is coming up so fast. No, you can't really catch those. Just test. Think fast! Incoming. Not now, Dad. Not now. Oh my Jesus Christ. Okay, what? What? Okay, we're on the other side. Screwing with my perspective. Oh my God. Ah. Oh my God. Okay, okay, okay. You know what the really ironic part about this is? Rick, up here. Before the cold, clammy hand of fear pulls you now, you can't really catch those. It's just test. You're not able to complete it's this without psychic catch. powers. Think fast. And what do we do? What do we do? Pretty good. There you go. Let me go over there. Stop throwing things over here, Dad. You used to like to play chats with me. There you go. I'm not a dog, Dad. I don't need catch. Holy mother of God. Here comes the water, boy. Think fast. Fuck! What the freaking heck? You used to like to play chats with me. Incoming. Oh my god. Okay, we made it. Now what? Do we go down? Oh, this is so dangerous. Oh my god. Oh, I don't know how we're doing this, but we're, we're doing it. So we're going upside down. We're going all over the place. It's working. Even the rings of fire are drowning in water. Oh my... 
I made it! You cheated! No! I used the acrobatics you taught me! Don't lie to me, cheater! You crystal ball readers always cheat! You're no son of mine! Hey, that's just being unfair. Oli, are you okay? Where's your dad? He's over there, talking to your dad. He did what? Uh-oh. Somebody's going to get grounded! Make that ground. <laughs> Wonderful. I guess in a way, this means that... No, you can't really catch those. I was just testing Oleander and us, Raz. We have the one... Oh, gee! No, 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 no! The one thing common between us is that Please we're plagued by our past with our dad. Oh. Wait. I can use telekinesis here, I think. Please, Mr. Barnett. Oh, God. Didn't work. Stupid, spiky, fingering, juggling pins. Who Is it working? Man, those things are. <laughs> oh, oh, we got him. Oh, no! Missed the chance again. <laughs> Here, buddy, buddy, Do we- can we just buddy. put it in the path where he's walking? Jeez. Like, if you just walk over them... Come here, buddy. No, it doesn't work. Oh, jeez. Oh! I'm done! I'm done! I'm stuck here. There you go. Let's go this way. Come here, oh, that's a lot of health. I'm getting pummeled though. Everyone, do you really care about your children? Okay, we need that health. We need the health so badly. So badly. I hope they haven't disappeared by now. Where is the health? Oh! Okay, full health. Let's try it again. Oh, jeez, not again. Mm. Dad? Uh, Oli's dad? Please, no. Let's keep a little bit of distance between us first. Come here, little buddy. Oh, jeez, not again. Oh my dear god, we are losing health super fast. Oh! I see your skull is as hard to penetrate as ever. Dad! What is your brain doing out here in this tank with this other brain? And who are all these unconscious people? What have you gotten yourself involved with, psychics? He's been cavorting with filthy, cheating psychics! Is that really? Is that really how I look in your mind? Man, do I hate psychics. And seeing my son happy. I don't hate psychics. I used my psychic connection with you to find you and to project myself into your mind. But how can you hate me for being psychic if you're psychic too? Son, I could never hate you. I only wanted you to be happy, Rasputin. And safe. Our family has many enemies. <laughs> A lot more hair than that. Now, son, we have to carefully unweave your psyche from that other brain. We don't want anything bad to happen while your mind is in this tangled state. 
The damage could be permanent. It already is. Unweave? Detangle? Never. I like it this way. I mean, look at how huge I am. And I think I can juggle now. <laughs> this is your mind, so you are the strong one here. But I'm about to give you, my son. You must take care of it, because it's everything I've got. Dragon Ball Z style, instant power up. Now that we're the same size, you want to fight? Can I use my abilities? I don't think so. Whoa! Kill the two-headed mon- Dad monster. Don't run! Or else daddy's gonna kill ya! I think you are gonna kill me. Okay, so our big form. We can't always use it. Oh jeez, he's really fast. Here, bunny, bunny, bunny. We can hit him while we're in this form. Which doesn't last too long. Oh, go, go, go! Behind, behind! Ah! Oh! Really? Okay, well there goes that. Let's try it again. Hey, got a head start this time. Come here, little bunny. Whoa! He's so fast! He's so fast! Oh my god. Okay, we just gotta hang in here so we bun, can become big. Bun, bun. Come on! Become big! Become big! Yeah! Come what is dad bunny. power? Our dad must be a pretty powerful psychic as well. Oh! Let's see if you remember your training. Okay, okay, okay. So close, so close. Come on, come on. Now, 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 Come on, son. Problem, little Oli. Bye bye. Wave goodbye, Mr. Bun. <laughs> Where's he going? We're separating the brains now, Rasputin. He'll be fine. Let's go inside. Man, I can't wait to tell you about all the messed up stuff that happened. Oh, I know a lot of it. While you were out, I poked around a bit. Tell me about this lily person. <laughs> <laughs> And so, that brings us to the end. Where, as you can clearly see, the personal demons causing my negative behavior have all been eradicated, leaving me sane once again. This is also corroborated in catch scan number three on page 59 of your handouts. On a personal note, I would just like to reiterate how extremely, extremely sorry I am for stealing all of your brains and trying to take over the world. Mistakes have been made. But this camp is all about education. And I know I, for one, learned plenty. Thanks to that guy right there. Come on up here, Raz. 
We endeavor to build strong minds here, with the power to lift things, to see things, to burn things. But it's a special quality of your heart, not your mind, that truly makes a great psychonaut. This young man has it. We did not give it to him. He got it from someone else long before he came here. <laughs> but we can give him this to honor his mind, his courage, and his heart. Son, we do not normally ask this of someone so young, but it is obvious to us all that you are not average. Will you join us, Rasputin? Will you be a psychonaut? <gasps> Wow, look at that! Cat hair! <laughs> okay, let's be perfectly clear about this. That was the best summer of my whole entire life. Hey, the summer's not over yet. We can hang out for a couple of weeks still. My family's out on the East Coast. Where's yours? They move around a lot. Hmm. Well, you'd better go. Your dad's waiting for you. Um, well... Bye. Children, it's an emergency. There's been another kidnapping. I was here the whole time. You saw me. No, this time we know who it is, and that's what scares us. Who was kidnapped? Truman Zanotto, the grand head of the Psychonauts. Dad! Sir, can you teleport this many of us back to headquarters? Huh? What? Hey, hey, what are you people doing in my kitchen? Now get! Guess we're taking the jet. Titanium powered. Don't worry about your dad, darling. We'll get him back. Yes, after all, we'll have Rasputin helping us. I'm going? Now how could we do this without our anti-kidnapping specialist? I've taught you everything I can, son. Now, you go show them. Show them all. Let's go. And that is the end of Psychonauts. Wow. Squeaky flower? Who the heck is that? Oh my god, Sasha and Bonita are the same guy? Wow. Lots of repeats. At the end there, I don't know if you noticed, but Ford Crawler, since remember how if he doesn't stay near the Titanium, then he can't remain sane? So to walk around camp, he was carrying around that huge block of Titanium on his back. I thought that was pretty cute. But yes, you see that kind of ending. That's why people want Psychonauts 2 so badly. And I guess I don't really have much else to say about it. It is one of my favorites. I think it's a super creative game. Every single level is truly unique. No repeats, no fillers. I think the best word to describe this work is creative. It's just really creative. And a really well fleshed out world. Which I really hoped you enjoyed as well. Uh, especially if you haven't heard about Psychonauts before. Of course, the main reason why I'm playing this is I want to experience it again and have some fun. But another big reason is I want to let more people know about this wonderful game because it really flew under the radar for a lot of people. So if you haven't heard of this before, I hope you got to understand what kind of a game Psychonauts is and understand why it has a cult-like following. It was an interesting experience for me as well even though it wasn't my first time playing. Over the past, I would say maybe four to five years, 
my style of gaming has completely changed. Like I used to be that person who glosses over everything too, so the first time I played I was just kind of going through the motions myself. But this time I really stopped to think about, you know, what's happening, why is it happening? And as you saw from the amount of achievements I got, there were lots of things that I haven't seen previously before. So I saw lots of new things and I hope you saw some new things too. So there you have it, Psychonauts 1. If you do want to know more about the game, especially the behind the scenes portion, I would suggest you head over to Double Fine's channel, their YouTube channel. They have a documentary called Colors of the Wind, I believe. It's a three-parter, 20 minutes each, so about an hour total, talking about the development of this game. And it was just like a really hard journey for everybody in that company. Multiple times, they ran out of money completely to the point where even wages and salaries couldn't be paid, so it's really a miracle that this game got made at all. Psychonauts 2 has been announced, and as of recording, the Kickstarter, or Fig, I think it's on a site called Fig, but it's a Kickstarter thing, campaign hasn't ended yet. I hesitate to recommend pledging because of the controversies Double Fine has had in the past, so I'll leave you to look into that if you'd like. But other than Psychonauts 2, what else was also announced was Psychonauts, Rhombus of the Ruin, and that's a PS4 VR game, that's all we know about it so far, and it's supposed to bridge the gap between Psychonauts 1 and 2. So it's gonna be immediately what happened after Psychonauts 1 here, aka rescuing Lily's dad. Um, I'd really like to play that title too, but for the moment, it does seem like it's a VR-only title. And I don't believe that by the time it comes out in 2016, this year, I will have a VR headset, so... Really hoping that it's just for PS4, because then otherwise I won't get around to playing it. A Psychonauts 2 is supposed to come out in 2018, so still quite a ways off. Lots of time to replay this title and possibly Psychonauts Rhombus of the Ruin again. Yeah, I super enjoyed playing this. Usually you wouldn't want to play too many old games and I hesitated about playing this too because it is an older title and some of the... Not the graphics itself, but just the low resolution of everything can be a little bit off-putting. But if you've made it this far, thank you so much for watching and I really hope that you enjoyed it. Psychonauts 1. Great game. I think that's pretty much all I have to say about it. I'll leave you to the rest of the credits. This was Matterwellens with Psychonauts, one of my favorites for sure. And I hope you enjoyed watching as much as I enjoyed playing. Thank you again and I'll see you all in another place in another time.